Hello, my name is Eric Jacobson, and welcome to Omnibus 2. Today I'll be taking you through some of the most famous scenes from some of the most famous books written. Let's get started. This scene from Eusebius is one of the most famous, the martyrdom of Polycarp. Take the oath and I will set you free. Curse Christ. How can I blaspheme the king who saved me? Burn him. What? The flames cannot quench him. Now we come to Augustine's conversion in the garden, a famous scene from his confessions. Why? Why can I not make an end of my sins now? Take it and read it. Take it and read it. This next scene is from Bede's Ecclesiastical History of the English People, Augustine going to King Ethelbert. And all the people said, Amen. I will also give you a place to settle and preach in Canterbury. Now it comes one of the most famed scenes from any ancient book, The Battle of Beowulf and Grendel. Now we come to the Battle of King Arthur and the Monster of Mount St. Michelle. Your Majesty, Duke Hoel's niece, Helen, has been captured by an enormous giant and fled to Mount St. Michelle. We leave at dawn. Look, there is a fire burning. Benavir, go scout it out. The giant has killed poor Helen. Do not worry, King Arthur is here. He will help you. This short scene is of Macbeth murdering King Duncan. This scene you are about to see shows the story of Sir Gawain and the Green Knight. I have a challenge to propose. Anyone may accept this challenge. If you cut off my head and I do not die, you will have to have your head cut off. I take this challenge. Nay, your majesty, it is I who should take this challenge. Very well. I will see you in a year and a day. Meet me at the Green Castle. So you have come? Yes, I have come to face the punishment. You have deceived me! You have the green satchel from Lady Burtlock! You are Lord Burtlock? Indeed! I must now return to Camelot. Now the time has come to travel through the nine layers of hell. Who are these men? These are Socrates, Plato, and Homer. These are the lustful. Here are the gluttons, forced to live in a freezing slush. Here the spindrifts push these heavy weights together. Who are these? They are the wrathful. They are always fighting. Here the heretics are trapped in flaming tombs. These are the violent. They live in burning sand forever. Who is this? This is the fraudulent man. He is buried upside down. And finally, here are the treacherous. They are trapped in the frozen ice and are guarded by Satan himself. Well, that's all. Hope you enjoyed it.